there, take it to the power, and put it back in motion, 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 and put it back in motion. Yeah, take it to the power, put it back in motion, and 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 put it back in motion. Let's do it, man. Yo, I pull up to the damn block, something that you can't top. I ain't talking red meat when I say the lamb chops. That? That's a lamb drop, that'll make these tramps hot. But I'm Damien Marley, I want to see a jam pop. Hit the club for a model that is sucker. She got 50 on my neck, straight model in your budget. You never see me short on a dollar, cause I does this. So tell a bartender, stop them bottles in the bucket. Hey, jewelry is frozen, blue it in the ocean. I make them girls drop it. And put it back in motion She asks what she gotta do to pull up on his coat And I tell her Yeah, take it to the power Put it back in motion And 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 put it back in motion Yeah, take it to the power Put it back in motion And put it back in motion 15 now You already see I ain't playing around Here we go to the phone. Yeah, I know y'all see it. Yeah, it's me getting down on pillows. Wanted to show y'all that. You know what I'm saying? Join me in the way, lost y'all. I see I'm getting started already. Y'all need to join me. Join me in a weight loss journey. Feel better about yourself. Make a difference in your life. I didn't even know you were going to say that. Well, I mean, of course, I'm going to listen to it, but I wouldn't think about that. <laughs> hey. I just chose A1. Like, like whatever plan it was. Drop <coughs> to the floor. We'll get into the conversation. Just let me get my little vibe on. Let's smoke up. I already know what I want to come in here and talk about. You got me enough trying to come on here and kick it. Um, we're going to get into some conversation. And we're going to get into some dispatch. We might have time for dispatch. But right now, I'm just chilling. Take it to the power, put it back in motion and put it back in motion and put it back in motion. 
motion and put it back in motion and put it back in motion and put it back in motion and yeah, take it to the pole, put it back in motion, and 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 put it back in motion. Let's do it, man. Well, I drop it out to the pole. I pull up to the damn block, something that you can't top. I ain't talking red meat when I say the lamb chops. That, that's the lamb drop, that'll make these tramps hot. But I'm Danny and Marley, I wanna see a jam rock, rock. Hit the club for a model that'll suck it. Yeah, 50 on my neck. Straight model in your budget well, You've never seen a short on a dollar Cause I does this I can tell a bartender Stop them bottles in the bucket hey, Jewelry is frozen Fluid than the ocean I make some girls drop it Then put it back in motion She asks what she gotta do To pull up on this open I tell her yeah, take it to the pole, put it back in motion, and 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 put it back in motion. Yeah, take it to the pole, put it back in motion, and 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 put it back in motion. Okay. to the pole. Girl, no one's Okay. Put makeup on, but I ain't about to waste this. I'm about to do something, take some selfies, get on the camera, something. For real, that's why I'm here. I'm like, fuck this shit, I gotta get on something. Come on here, about I know we brought 12 minutes in already. I know you like damn about time, but I have to get to the flow. So, what I want to talk about is. I want to talk about something that's on my mind. I feel like it's the appropriate time to talk about it since it is that time of season where there's a lot of this is going on. Um, and I want to just, you know, put things in perspective, at least try from my point of view as much as I can as possible um, to try to put things in perspective for you, give you a better understanding. Of what it is, you know, you might be thinking and whatnot, um, and it kind of helps you guide your, your you know, kind of help you guide yourself to your thoughts or whatnot. Um, the spirit of worry is unwanted, it's a sin. I kind of touched on this, but the spirit of worry, you know, and anxiety. It's, uh, it's harmful and it's detrimental to you physically and also in the spiritual realm. Um, things, and you may not feel like you worry about things because, you know, you ignore things and you're not just as vocal about things as much, but that may be so, but at the same time, you may also be the type of person who worries by thinking about it and not, you know, dropping the subject. Another sign of worrying is when you repeat yourself. Like, as far as repeating yourself, like, Keep talking about it, keep bringing it up. 
not letting it go. Not, you know, as people say, put it in God's hands, you know. Um, a lot of people we invite bad things into our life because of this trait, because of this bad characteristic, this bad habit that we that we obtain through whatever we, you know, our upbringing or whatever we saw, observe, coming up, you know, pick up that trait or worrying. Um, and worrying basically is the opposite of practicing the faith of being hopeful. Um, I believe that as a man thinks, so is he. So when you worry about things and when you're not so sure you have anxiety, that's what you are. You know, you are worry. You are anxiety. You are issues. You are problems. As a man think of so is he. So you think positive. You think you know everything. You know everything will be all right. Then you are all right and a positive person. And when you possess that spirit of worryness, you cause more issues than solutions. Um, worrying to me also kind of going coincide with emotions and you know so you know controlling your emotions also can help you with this practice as well as you know practicing not worrying you know practicing faith um you can invite negative things into your life just by worrying And I noticed that I grew up in a church, so I can only speak from that point of view. And what I noticed is, I noticed that in the church, it practiced a lot of worry. Every time something goes on, or something wrong, or somebody like the first thing they do is they pray about it, pray about it, get your knees, cry about it, pray about it, plea about it. Um, to me, it's great to pray, it's great to pray. I'm not going to tell them I ain't got to pray, but um, certain times, certain things, you know, um, doesn't even require prayer. Like, I'm a strong believer in whatever I want, whatever my heart desire is, as long as it's in the right will and order, it's going to happen for me. Um, and I'm also a person that instead of telling people or instead of practicing crying and praying about something when I need something that doesn't go right, I just like to start being thankful that it's going right, that it's happening, that, you know, I obtained it, whatever my goal is, whatever it is my desire is. I'm more so a thankful person. I practice being thankful. I practice being appreciative. I like to practice good faith, good faith practices, basically. Um, I know it's just that time of year where people are worried about buying their kids gifts. You know what I mean? Uh, I know some people are even worried about. Um, Toys and PS5 and this and the third, which is, you know, hey, every parent wants to get a child to desire their heart, which is great and fine. I would never tell nobody not to do that or want that for their, you know what I'm saying? But what your child needs and what they want is going to happen if it's meant to be. And sometimes you have to explain to children, like, maybe you just can't get it now, you know, rise up the time. But later on, you know, when things are looking up, you know, it'll come later, you know what I mean? So, there's a lot of ways you can handle situations. And, um, find a different approach instead of feeling always like, you know, You gotta accomplish this, or it's like the end of the world. It's like mm, more than likely, at least seven to eight times out of ten, a child will understand. You know what I'm saying? For the most part, I'm depending on their age and their maturity level, it's like and what you talk to them, you know. But more than likely, a child can understand, like your mom, parents, dad, whatever, guardian. 
may not have it at the moment. And then understanding what's going on in the world today. You know, if they're explained, I'm pretty sure they know about what's going on. So, I just really feel like you bring unwanted spirits and unwanted energy and unwanted results in when you were, when you practice the spirit of worrying. I feel like in the church, they should always they should start practicing the spirit of praising and being thankful. Because the first thing they do is, like, okay, let's pray about it, let's take a minute about it. What happened? Give your testimony, like, you know, like, it just be a down, it just be a downward, like, you know what I mean? Like, it's just not positive, it's just, I don't know, it's just the energy feels down to me. Like, I wish I was, I wish my upbringing church was. Oh, you want this? You want that? Be thankful. Feel it. Speaking to existence. You know, they do say that, but they also, like, pray, 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 and pray. Just a sign of worrying because some people will pray, 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 and pray because they say pray without ceasing or whatever. But God heard you. God knows what you want. You know what I'm saying? Like, I told them, like, for example, I use dial soap. I knew I needed some more. Somebody gave me a pair of two bars. I didn't even ask them. I didn't even tell them I needed it. That's how powerful your thoughts are and what you want your desires is. I literally did not tell anybody not to sew. I just thought about it yesterday or today in the shower. One of the two. I was like, I need some more dye. Next thing I know, I see two bars of dye. Just like that. Somebody gave it to me. So, I told that story about my bike. My bike kept coming damaged. Long time for shipping there and back and all this extra shit. And people coming out, home services. Wanted to get my bike for free. You feel me? Because I didn't worry about it. I didn't fret about it. I actually had in my heart, my mind said, no, I'm keeping my bike. I'm keeping my bike. Some way they going to give my bike. And I even went to the point where I was like, y'all, give me a discount. You know what I'm saying? I was asking for a discount just to keep my bike. But they, you know, in the bad condition that it was in, you know, the damaged condition that it was in. So, which the bike is right here. <laughs> I just, you know, had it, my, had it on my mind, on my heart, you know. In the church, I noticed people always be like, it's the devil, it's the devil, it's in the third. My thing of it is this. He's a liar. Everybody know that, right? Whatever you feel like the devil is. Some people think it's a state of mind. Some people think it's a real entity. I feel like it's, it could be a spirit, okay? It's a, it's, a, it's a good spirit. It's the Holy Spirit, which I have. And then I'm sure it's a bad spirit. It's a good and bad. It's a flip side to everything, right? So, I'm sure it's a entity um, that doesn't have best interests, okay? All right? People's best interests. People's souls and their salvation are their best interests, right? So, you know. But we want to give them a name today, and it's, and it's the enemy, okay? The adversary. Um, a lot of people be like, oh, it's still, it's coming, he's doing it, it's out there. I'll be like this, but that motherfucker got a problem. He's narcissist as it is, okay? He tried to, he run heaven, okay? <laughs> Stop giving that nigga so much credit, clout, and yeah, credit and clout and acknowledgement. Stop it. Some things you never know. God could be interfering in things. You never know why you didn't get something at that time. Some people think like this happened, that happened because of the enemy. Well, you have to look at everything to come out real good. I don't care what it is. Say some, say something. Say Lord or divine. Energy, I know something good that's going to result into this, and I'm receiving, and I receive it, and I'm thankful for it now. You know, what I'm saying? I don't care what it is. <laughs> don't be so quick to blame the enemy because I give him credit, and I'm losing his ego, and then it gets you to worry, and then he knows it could be any little thing that he can see it being done. He knows that he's going to get praised in the way. To me, that's praising him. Like, um, to me, that's in the praise in the way because we already know he's a liar. We already know that he. So if you tell me he's a liar, he, he's a cause of he's doing nothing but glow. That's not an insult. You know what I'm saying? So I don't even acknowledge that motherfucker. I don't. I just be like, 
Lord, I make a way out of no way. Divine, whatever it is meant for me, it's gonna be. I'm thankful now. Thank you for that. You feel me? Let the divine will be done. Let it, let it work out for my favor. Whatever it's gonna be. I don't know how it's gonna happen, but whatever it is, let it work, work out for my favor. Or anything bad happens to me and my family. You feel me? You just gotta learn your words and spells and how to be powerful and use them. You know what I'm saying? Starve that nigga out. Don't be giving his ass no fucking credit. Your husband cheating, no, that's the devil. Don't get that nigga no credit. That's that nigga, you got your husband, period. So everybody can say on free will. You feel me? That's okay, you gotta make everybody praise him. Can't make everybody do nothing. You got their own will, niggas know what they be doing. You know what I'm saying? Um, shit, that bitch told my man to her third guy. Can't steal a nigga, right? That bitch ain't put a gun to his head. They take a litter out there. But wherever y'all at, or just whatever, whatever. Ain't no such thing. That motherfucker's weak mind. Just look at that ass shit. Okay, you moving out the way because I got a bigger blessing. You move, you get moved out the way because I, I'm behind in life messing with you. I got somebody who's making so much more money. Or treat me so much more better. All of that. Okay? And I'm missing out. Like me. I used to be worried about my ex baby and I'm so happy he's gone. You don't understand. I would never have found myself. I would not know how I want to do in life. I would not know me. I would not have leveled up mentally and spiritually and physically as I have been. You feel me? Get my mind right, get myself right. So much better. And what he doing? He's even worse than the condition that he was in when he left, right? He's getting he's huge. Like, unhealthy. Like, I mean, he was almost three when he was around me. And I know he done gained at least another hundred pounds. But I know weight. I know that because I'm, I'm, I'm a heavy person right now. So I know that now. And I was small, I didn't know that. Now I know that. You feel me? Look. <laughs> okay. Me. I did want to do makeup, okay? I got more pictures I can show, but I ain't about to get up to do all that. So I know that now, okay? He's at least 400. He got a big keloid in the back of his head. It's huge. I'm like, oh, the fuck that come from? So, you know what I say? That's not worry about it. He dogged me out, talking about my body to some extent. Fat shame me, you feel me? Then he ain't come home to that. You know what I'm saying? Like, he like, he ain't come home to that. So, okay. I'm glad you got on. You feel me? Cause I ain't want to stay with nothing like that. And it's like, I'm so thankful. <laughs> yeah. You know, I just want to let you know that things get better. Like, I used to think I didn't know what I was going to do, who I wanted to be, what I want to do with my life. I had no clue. I, he was a whole plan on everything. Okay? I worried like a mud. And I worried for nothing. All the time I was worrying, crying, I could have been up leveling up my skill. Finding out how to level up from your man, from your ex, you know what I'm saying? That's why I be trying to, you know what I'm saying, encourage encourage females on here that is not in no quote unquote real relationship. Because if you think you got a little boyfriend, I don't need his money, I just need his time and his affection and him to call me. I'm not talking about you. I don't, I'm not talking about your kind. All that so called real relationship, I'm not into that. All about you know, bettering yourself, benefiting, you know, for security, for seeking security. All that cute shit, he fine, he popular, no. He so drugs, no. I used to do the dope man, all that. All that shit, no way. Shit for the back. Okay? Get you somebody that who's popular now. Monique is in the news now. Monique from the Parcel of the Comic. She's real fine. She ain't got an old, old man, but that nigga is like the beast. 
okay? So it makes her look like beauty. So that's why her man is so much for for there for her and love and adore her. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and if that baby gay he is, he's still gonna be there because I mean, what girl really wanna want him unless she got gay? You know what I'm saying? But he probably know he can't get nothing better than my week. You know what I'm saying? Cause, like, all these other, cause most most women are vain. Like, oh, he gotta be fine. He gotta be tall, dark, and handsome. Girl, you losing. You gonna be losing with that one. Cause men, age Florida men. Women age much faster. So, y'all on the same age, make sure she's ugly and paid. Okay? That's just on everything. The way you always had an upper hand. In the relationship, always be a beneficial, always be a good position. You know what I'm saying? So, you call them years, all right? Time to enjoy that make up on them dates, all that fake, or whatever, consoling him, listen to his shit, all that extra shit, being the ear, companion. You deserve a payoff, okay? <laughs> Being his, being his peace, okay? His peace of mind, his relaxation after he's working. Yeah, you deserve, you deserve that luxury house and car, vacation, commodities, okay? Go no, all that. So, where I am trying to film something. But I am still, because I'm saying, like, I was worried about that. Just, and now, he's not there. He's so fucking huge. He's like 400 some pounds. He's into my head. It's out there, but that is huge. I'm just like, what? Anybody 400 pounds needs to lose weight yesterday. I'm gonna go fuck who you are. I'm saying it's still shit, shit unfucking healthy. Period. Unhealthy. And the way shit going in the world, they might have our asses running from down where we might need to be running and hopping fences and shit and rolling on in ditches and whatever and crawling. Doing the army crawl on our. You know what I'm saying? We gotta get in shape. <laughs> For real. Now was at the time. And I told y'all my intuition told me earlier this year. <clears throat> Start getting serious about your way. Yeah, I'm thankful. It was not the first time I lost weight this year. I lost weight beginning of the quarantine, before quarantine came, before March. I was losing weight. Began through the quarantine, I just started gaining. And now, it's the end of the year. I'm already, you know, before New Year's hit, people in their resolution. Oh, my resolution is this. No, I'm already done started it, okay? That's another thing. Why you gotta wait till a certain day? Do it now. If it's on your mind, do it now. If you're not gonna do it now, you're not gonna do it then. Because the longer you wait, the harder it fucking gets. You is the everyday, day by day, motherfucking blessing, okay? Because every day you get older, every day they go by, you get an older, alright? So. Use the shit, use the time wisely, baby. Use the time wisely. So. So, yeah. Anyway. How do y'all feel about that? What I'm talking about? I need y'all to compensate with me. Compensate. Yeah. You know what I mean? I need you to converse with me. 
I need you all to talk to me in the comment section. I'm sleepy. Okay, I'm sleepy too. So conversate, I can say that. As long as it ain't for a long period of time. Okay. But, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So everything is gonna be alright, y'all. Um, yeah, it is coming up. It's slowly creeping up on us. Uh, I got something else right before the new year. Oh, so y'all gonna share me surprise? I got another surprise. I probably already talked to y'all about it in my other videos, but I have to talk about it lately. So yeah. I got another enhancement, another improvement that I'm doing to myself. It's December 30th. I will tell you the date. December 30th. So. December 30th. I might come on. I might just do a whole video on it. I might just do, you know, film it. So, yeah, that's a good idea. I think I should. I think I should feel my experience. <laughs> That way, I can always, you know, I can wait back on it for myself. Yeah, yeah, I'm on my shit, y'all. I'm telling you. Hey. Enhancing myself, getting back to my old self. You know what I'm saying? Um, just coming up with solutions, you know, because when you worry, that like make you make your thoughts cloudy, make you not be able to think, you know? And you won't be able to start, you know, think rationally, start coming up with a solution, thinking logically, you'll just be like stuck. And the feeling of anger and madness, and it's like when you could be coming up with a, a resolution, you know, you know, rectifying the situation in a much, a much better time and fashion. Because worry don't do nothing but bring on the problem. Being thankful and having gratitude, having faith, you know, praising God and all that. That is what's going to attract because the universe doesn't have no choice but to give you what you want or whatever your desire is or make better provisions for you. You know what I'm saying? Whatever it is is going to be in your favor. It's going to be in your favor. The divine will be going in your favor, okay? Long as in his will. And that's what y'all got to keep you be worrying. You gotta get that to your head. Being thankful is the key. I don't care what's going on. Being thankful. That's the move to make. You know what I'm saying? I just really feel like that's from my heart today. I tell y'all, other stuff was added bonus, but mainly the start worrying is the thing. You feel me? The negative is low vibrational energy, however you classify it. Okay, it's the adversary to get this. Crying and adversary, all that's against you. Crying and worrying is against you. Sometimes you can let it out. You can cry for a minute, let it out. You know what I'm saying? No, I mean, you do cry to let that shit out. That's that. Just two steps off, okay? Because all you're doing is tracking more events. It'll be, it'll be dumb up there. You, everything you know, it's like, damn, why bad things always happen to me? It's on the third. It's because of the energy you put out there. The thoughts. You know what I mean? Think here and be here. Think safe and be safe. Think rich and be rich. Think wealthy and be wealthy. Think victory has a victory. You know what I mean? 
hands on you humpers. Up on the wall, posted on the rail like a pump. Slide off, show me what she's wearing a thunder. Before I get a name, and she spares me a number. Pocket full of money, mother. Nah, I ain't a dummy. No, she won't see a dollar till she drop it like she clumsy. Honey, I'm getting scrapped here. That's a couple stacks, yeah. All you get from me is a pizza and some cab fare. On the way out, she'll look and ask us that fair. I'll tell her. Well, wait, yeah, take it to the pill and put it back in motion 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 and put it back in Six two shows for one. But yeah, y'all, like three channel. Don't forget to subscribe. Come kick it with me. We are gonna be kind of. We got all kind of be okay. And we're celebrating the fact that they got we we go on a federal level now. So shout out to everybody who got in prison for not like crying the okay? I'm here on a level. Shout out to y'all. I'm a lady. I'm a fella. Get into the green rush. Okay. I smoke out of my eyes. Get into the green rush. Alright. Do not get used to this background because it's not. The background for this. This is my makeup channel background. I usually have my lap and lap on. I might have some candles lit. Okay. But it's cold and I'm gonna fuck it outside. It's snowing. I said fuck that shit. We are not hot boxing it today. And I put on my wig. I'm gonna put my robe on. Put my wig on. Oh, yo, hear that? Okay. Very, very pretty. That shit is crazy. It happened twice tonight. You done said the same thing in a damn song. The fuck? Lucky it's recording because nobody would believe me. <laughs> and I got the green light. Okay. Hey, a little thing going on. Hey. So that's the thing here. The green light with the green light and the green light. Hey, the green light, the green light, and the green light. Hey, the green light. I have the little green orange with the little makeup I did today. Stephanie, first of all, you was not about to just interrupt my dang um motherfucking live like that, Stephanie. But yeah, take it to the floor. Stephanie. Stephanie tried it, didn't she? Why ain't coming into my lip? That's my baby cousin used to call it lip. Lip. She was like, two, one. She was like, lit. I'm trying to lose things with her. Or some chapstick. Okay. And baby says, she was like, all day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just four, four, four. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, thank you so much for tuning in. I'm fake, y'all, with this smile. I'm really creepy as fuck. 
I'm just trying to be cordial for the motherfucking video. Okay, but I'm tired. I'm gonna I cannot wait to wash this shit off my face. I can the ass and wash it. And take it to the bed. And take it to the motherfucking bed, okay? Okay. It's always almost a motherfucking weekend. I don't have shit planned, obviously. We take care of it. I need to call this one lady back. I just thought about it. I just said my thoughts out loud. I need to call somebody back. But yeah, I, I'm just, you know, I'm trying to get my bike fixed, y'all. I had to send us some pictures so my bike is messed up, screws out. They doing the most. They gonna come back and fix my shit. I'm not fucking playing with them. They never fucking ass. Okay. Okay. I my fucking ass when I do all this clean shit. Okay, I feel my five pictures. All different angles. You know, the screws, park loose, bitch. You know what to do. Okay, I'm so motherfucking. Dude. <laughs> We're gonna do a week kind of on uh, motherfucking Facebook or Instagram. If you want to do on Instagram, so Instagram, but we kind of actually, I got a week kind of Instagram. I need to post some pictures. This could be cute. I should screenshot this. How can I screenshot this? Okay. Yeah, I hope that. I hope that. I hope that's the take. You <laughs> only snapped out of one picture. I don't like how this last was an up, though. You feel me? Yeah, I should have the picture out of her. I gotta have a last shot. I'm funny like that. I'm trying to know my sign. Besides dollar sign, besides dollar sign, besides dollar sign. I want my little joint. This still did it. I looked up that time <laughs> at the extra camera. So that's gonna be this picture. I wanna post that picture on Weed Kinda. I think it's Weed Kinda LLC. I think that's what it's gonna be. Or just Weed Kinda. Or just Weed Kinda. Whatever one. I'm trying to let these videos go almost up to it's time to go. Well, we're about to wrap this shit up anyway. Uh, it done dragged on. I think I done left my motherfucking message. I done got out everything I had to say, really. Pretty much, you already get the point. So I hope that made you feel better about whatever those situations you guys are in right now. Because there ain't no situation. I already saw. You already got the victory. You already got what you desire. You feel me? It's already good. It's already in the spiritual realm, ready to manifest into the natural. But you gotta say, what you say has to be greater than that. You have to say it's already here in the natural. Okay? It's already here. Period. And you're thankful. That's all I need. You know what I'm saying? 
for people to get through their head, you know what I'm saying? Because that's what I learned, and it's been working wonders, you know what I'm saying? I'm not saying that, you know. Yeah. Not saying don't be concerned about things, you know what I'm saying? As, you know, paying attention to it or doing something about it, doing, you know, like taking necessary steps for it to be the goal. But, you know what I'm saying? Not saying be too relaxed on it, but just know that whatever the end is going to be. And if something is not going through, something you're trying to do right now, and you just like obstacles keep coming. And it's just like, you know, it just seems like it's the force of the shit to fit, you know what I mean? Like, you can't have to do this, like, it is not going through. Leave it alone. Just leave it alone. Some way, somehow, it's going to work out. Some way, somehow, whatever you're trying to do is not working because it's supposed to work out another way. Okay, another way if you don't have a clue you have you no clue on how if this is going to work out it's going to be unthinkable it's going to happen you know what I'm saying so just know that everything is working in favor so that's why it won't work out the way you that's why you're sweating and you going through a lot to try to make whatever it is right and try to work out feel good you're not able to do it because it's another way it's going to happen. And it's going to benefit for you. And you're going to find that it's so much more easier. It seems hard and difficult. But the solution is so much more easier. And it is not as hard as you're making it seem. It is not as hard as you're making it out to be. Okay? You can manifest much, much more easier. You just relax and stay calm and just receive it. And make the blessings for us. I love you so much. So glad you tuned in. I will see you guys in the next video. Subscribe, 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 subscribe. I love you guys. Good night. Good time with it. Yeah, okay. Oh, freaking night. Drop the